when you start preaching the gospel, the truth, and you start pointing people to Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Yahshua Hamashiach, then you find out who your real friends are. Guess what? They few and far between because the sword of the Lord is the spoken word of God coming out of a man or a woman that is completely surrendered to the Lord and will not compromise. A man or a woman of God that will not compromise and they are strong in their convictions and they know that the sword of the Lord will bring correction. It will bring direction. It will bring offense and it will bring division. That's what a sword does. It divides and it separates. It kills the flesh. And we don't want to die to the flesh. You don't know what spirit you're of. Because if you understood what spirit you were of, you would know that God did not send his son in the likeness of man so that there would be peace when he came the first time, but rather division, a sword. And every man, woman, and child that speaks of the sword of the Lord, which is the word of God, the spoken word of God, who is Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the Lord of lords and the King of kings, God in the flesh, there's going to be division, there's going to be separation, there's going to be arguments, because the flesh refuses to die. So I'm going to keep applying the sword to the flesh. And I'm going to live for the Lord. I'm going to preach the gospel in season, out of season, when they want to hear it and when they don't. Saints, God bless you. I love you. Let the sword of the Lord be upon your lips constantly. Let the fire of Kadesh Ruach burn in you so that when the word comes out, it's not you speaking it. It's the Holy Spirit speaking through you. You live and move and have your being through him. God bless you. I love you. It's sister with a testimony.